All right, I'm on hole number 13 of the Stateside Classics Tournament. I'm in the opening round of the rookie division. I just want to look at the hole. And it is at Santa Ventura hole number four. I'm just going to glance at it. And then we're going to go pick this stuff. I'm on a, I've hit two hole ones on this, both on perfect, perfect shots. So you got to hit, you got to hit perfect. I took a Kingmaker and a uh, Grim Reaper on both of them. You can use a Titan. It's just you have less wind to deal with. And where you're at up there, depending on the wind that you're getting, if you're getting headwind, it helps because it gives you a little bit more room to your red line. Okay, so hole number four. Let me put some numbers in my calculator. So it's a 10% wind adjustment. So it's 1.1 times whatever the wind is. And it's at 1.8 per ring. And I have a spot. And if I don't catch it here, you can go back and watch hole number four on the front side of this. And there's a spot out there. And if you're in that spot and you hit it perfect, it goes in the hole. These must be a recent ball that sold, and I can't remember what they do. Let's see if they open it up and do their adjustment. We can see what the ball does. It's a power five. So, oh, there you go. There you go. I was going to say. This is, I think the traditional, most people are going to go out it on this side. They feel comfortable going out it on this side. I've hit on the lower shot bouncing over the sand. I've hit that a couple times and made hole in ones on that, but I've also epic failed. <laughs> and I can tell you from personal experience that if you get caught in that sand, and I'm not sure if they do it, if it's still like that, but you can't, you can't hit over it. You've got to hit back. I, th I don't think it's as steep as it used to be. Let's do the win first. 1.1 times 3.2 equals divided by 1.8. It's going to be 1.95 rings. Max back spin, one right hand side spin. Let's find the spot. That's the spot right there. Look at my second bounce. I'm on the outside corner up there. 3.2, 1.95 rings. So almost two rings. need to hit it perfect. Ah! Oh, hit it great to the right. And if you look up there behind, there's a bunch, the way that this hill goes, there's a ridge right here. And there's a little valley, a trough that runs down to the cup. And if you hit to the great, great to the left or the right, you'll be on the, on one side or the other of that little trough. And you're way the hell off. <laughs> Just trying to go for the three hole in ones in a row. No perfecto. I don't like these kind of putts. And I missed it. I definitely do not like those kind of putts. Oh no, that'll piss me off. <laughs> that means I dropped two shots. That means I'm not going to get my practice account in. I have been practicing shots in it, but I'm not going to be able to get it in. All right. That's how you miss a putt. That's how you miss. That's how you, you bring a kingmaker to a par three and you miss a putt. <laughs> that was hole number 13 of the Stateside Classic Tournament. Thanks for watching.